Right now, Benghazi Select Committee Chairman Trey Gowdy is here to go on the record. Today, news that the release of the highly anticipated Benghazi report will now be delayed until 2016. That means the report will come out right in the middle of the presidential election year. And House Speaker John Boehner is blaming the Obama administration and former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton. The administration has made it virtually impossible to get to the facts surrounding Benghazi. The Republican chairman of the Special Benghazi Committee is now suggesting he might put out his final report just a few months before the 2016 election. They could clean this up a whole lot quicker if the administration and Secretary former Secretary Clinton were in a position to actually cooperate. Has Hillary Clinton gotten back to you? Uh, she has not, but her lawyer's been good about getting back. They've got uh, a lot more work to do. And Benghazi Select Committee Chair Trey Gowdy joins us. Nice to see you, sir. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Um, you realize if this comes out after the end of this year, into the year 2016, um, the credibility is going to be pinched because people are going to say that it's political. You wait to uh, Secretary Clinton was running for president. Uh, it could be. Of course, that assumes that the report would be critical of her, and I don't make that assumption because we're, we're still in the process of gathering facts. If the, if the report is is not critical of her, then she would probably want it to come out closer to the election. But it's not going to come out in the middle of 2016. I hope it doesn't come out in 2016 period. I hope we're done before the end of this year. And I say hope because there are certain variables that I cannot control. All right, what's the problem? Why, I mean, why isn't this moving faster? Documents. It's simple. It is whether or not the Department of State, the Department of Justice, the Department of Defense will honor our request for documents. Some of those requests are as old as two years old. All right. So, so um, I've, it seems to me, if you've made these document requests and they have not been complied with by a certain date, drop dead date, I would probably make sometime in November of this year, I would say that it's pretty fair to, uh, in, in the courtroom, as you and I are both from, to draw an adverse in, inference, meaning that it would be unfavorable to the administration. Uh, you could, to the administration, absolutely. If, if DOD were not producing documents to us, um, you could draw that inference. I am reluctant to draw a negative inference about the Department of Defense or our military. Uh, you're right, in a courtroom that happens. I'm not sure in the court of public opinion that people are going to draw a negative inference. I think that they would just conclude, well, Gowdy, you finished too quick. You, 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 should, have, you should have waited until the documents came in. Has Secretary Clinton cooperative? Uh, cooperative from the standpoint that she's never once uh, evidenced a lack of willingness to come in and talk to us. Well, that's, I mean, it's a lack of willingness. Sure, I'll come in and talk to you like in 10 years. I mean, I mean, if you said no, to no, her, no. I want you here on, on July 5th, and if she said she will. She would have come in November of 2014. But, but think back to no November of 2014. That's when David Kendall and Elijah Cummings wanted me to bring her. That was before we had her emails. So I would, if I, I had done. Still don't, though. Well, uh, well, we have 300 now. We had eight in November of 2014. So if I had done what they asked me to do and expedited this, I would have had a conversation with her in the dark. I, I would not have had her email. Could you not, I mean, could you not just bring her back and say, look, now we found, you gave me eight emails, now I have 292 more. You didn't give them to me before, uh, so now come back and talk to me about Absolutely. this. Absolutely, and then someone would say, you are bringing her back and forth before your, it's harassment, you're vindictive, you should have just called her once. I mean, we're, we're trying to do this the right way, which is gather the evidence and have a single conversation with her about Benghazi. But Greta, there are two people who could expedite this process much quicker than me or you or Elijah Cummings. And they are? President Obama and John Kerry. They, President Obama controls the administration and John Kerry controls the State Department. If they sent a message to the folks that are reviewing our document request, give these folks what they need to complete their report or give them a legal reason why you're not going to, but quit playing this game about asking for priorities and what do you need first and are you sure you really need it? Give them what they asked for. This would be done much sooner than 2016. Have you asked, if Secretary, they do it. Have you asked Secretary Kerry, President Obama? I mean, let's stop playing the games. If these are documents I want, we have, we have the right to ask for this document either, you know, Give them to us. Or well, I have not had that conversation with President Obama. We have been very clear with the Department of State. The sooner you comply with our request, the sooner this will wrap up. But look what happened with the emails, Greta. They didn't bother to tell us they didn't have her record. 
So when I say I've lost confidence in the State Department's objectivity, that's exactly why. All right. Well, um, I hope it gets done sooner than later. And I realize that you're not getting all the documents. But if uh, if it doesn't get done by the end of the year, I think it's fair. Uh, you know, do you lay out who, who dragged his feet, who wouldn't give you documents, and what was in the way? And I think the American people can, you know, make a draw a fair inference from that. I want it done before 2016 and, and to, to that end. We're doing four witness interviews a week, whereas we were doing two. That's ambitious for a staff our size, four. We're trying to accelerate it, but I've got to have the documents. Chairman, nice to see you, yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. And